Okay, let's just turn to page 35 in our books and begin our lesson, I guess. And so this is the answer. Why? I just showed it to you. Was I this dumb as a kid? <laughs> All right, kids, let's uh, settle down so we can start our lessons here. Seriously, though, <laughs> I'm really nice, but I can't foresee what I will do if you keep annoying me. So. And that is how you do fractions. I don't understand why you can't get it. What are you, a bunch of kids or something? Oh, wait. Oh, I have an idea. Okay, how about if you all be very good and listen to me, I will bring you all some ice cream tomorrow. Yeah? You like that? Okay, all right, so then shut up. Okie dokie, kids. Let's try to make this as painless as we can, all right? According to my teacher's book here, I'm supposed to ask you kids, what is it called when it rains? It starts with a P. Pee pee? No, not. Okay, yeah. Okay, let's, let's settle down. Let's be mature here, all right? Shh, everybody be quiet, listen up. You all may be spoiled little brats, and I may be very frustrated, but that doesn't matter. You know why? Because it is my job to turn you all into bright little Einsteins, which is what's gonna happen, okay? Let's do this. Okay, okay, let, come on, let's pay attention. Man, this is harder than I thought. I thought I liked kids before this. So the answer is two. Why? Because I said so. Is that good enough for you, Jimmy? Okay, let's turn in our homework assignments. Come up over here and turn in. No one did their homework? I am so disappointed in you kids. Now, I love you. I really do. But I'm going to show you a whole new meaning to the word tough love. I can't do this. I was born to lead men. This is infinitely harder. Okay, class, today we are going to be talking about Pythagorean theorem. When you have a right triangle, a squared plus b squared equals c squared. Teacher, I, I have a question. No questions until after class. Hold on to all your questions, write them down, and we will get to each one of them in order of relevancy, okay? Pay attention. I can't do this. Hey, why don't we go on an educational field trip? How does that sound? Yeah? Learn something out there in the real world, right? Let's go. Okay, class, before we begin, let's establish some ground rules, all right? Rule number one is I'm always right. And if I'm ever wrong, see rule number one. So the answer is seven. Why? Because it's more than six and less than eight, all right? All right, kids, how you all doing? Let's quiet down and be very good because if not, I will call your parents and I will talk to them about you for a very long time. I am not afraid to do that, okay? So let's, uh, let's begin. Let's begin by repeating our class rules. Rules are very important because if we don't follow them, our world will collapse and so will my patients, okay?